Hi guys, uh, today we are going to do a APC. Um, I'm sorry if I sound like weird, it's just that I'm shivering because I'm so cold today. Um, so, I've got a few bits and bobs here. You can use whatever you like, but I've got like some scrap paper. Uh, some music paper and uh, this here that Zoila gave me but I don't know whether to use this side or just use the right side I'm not sure yet um, I might actually just use I'm gonna see it guys hi uh, so I'm just going to use my book I think um, so I need to cut a bit out, pick, pick one I like and cut it out. I don't really like any of these. Um, I'll just maybe use this one since it's the first page anyway. So, I'm just going to uh, cut this out, stick it down for the background and maybe add a wee bit more to it. Oh, it's freezing! Um, right, what's I doing now? So, please excuse me, I'm a bit disorganised today as you can tell. Um, I'm going to use my Mod Podge for the first time. I've had it for weeks, about two weeks now, three weeks, and I've not used it yet, so I'm going to use it now. And so this is a bit off the lid. It should truly really be attached, but it's not. And I'll just, I'm just going to stick this down randomly in the belt, it's not going that well. Please excuse his cheesy music in the background as well. It's I'm watching Indiana Jones. Oh god, I hope I heat up soon. So I went to the doctors this morning and my arm is healed. Um the doctor I think he was pretty surprised because uh, he's like you feel pretty quick considering you only got the operation a week ago. Um, he says basically for being a 29 year old, um, I feel really quick. Um, I've healed, what's it he says, I feel just as quick as a 16 year old would heal, so I'm well chuffed with that. Um, and, uh, Um, but I think it's maybe the antibiotics that I've been taking as well that's helped to, to heal a bit quicker so I'm not really caring anyway I'm just glad I'm healed so always good with that I've still got to go back to the dentist but we'll see what happens with that so as I say, I've just basically took a random jelly plate or jelly print or even if you've just got like maybe a clean up, um, a clean up uh, page that you use to clean your brushes, clean your paint up or whatever. So this is what I've got. Right, I really do suggest you do that guys. If you've got a spare book, take the cover off. Um, if it's like put together like this and it's all glued together just take the cover off and use your book for when you're doing your clean up or, or uh, your jelly plating printing because it's really good and it gives you all these pages and then all you need to do is find the page you want and just tear it off and that's you so uh, I really suggest you do that it's just a wee tip for you I really liked idea of doing it. it was just something I came up with. I had the book lying about so I thought okay, I'll just use that to clean up. 
So I've not really got anything in mind at the moment, so I'm just kind of going um, along, do you know? So what we'll do is we'll, I don't know what to use this so. oh yeah, I'm use this. So I'm just going to tear bits off of this. And uh, put it down. This can get used to something else. So it's kinda that's a bit too much weight, I think. So as I say, you can use it whatever you want. Like if you've got substitutes for what I'm using, then use that. It's entirely up to you what you use. Um, this is going to be my last challenge uh, because um, till next month. Because the girls, obviously, it's like coming up to the new year and it's pretty busy for me because um, I spend it with my family and um, it's going to be my birthday and stuff. So I'm not going to be around <laughs> much. I'll still pop in and say hello to people and. If I can get a chance to put a video up a ball, I should have really inked that first. But I don't know where my ink is, so I'll just need to do it the way it is. Maybe. I'll stick these down first and see. So, as I see, I'm just playing around here. See what I get. <laughs> see what I can come up with. We just plain, nothing planned, just um, doing it as I go along. So. so that's that. In fact, I'll probably cover up these edges, I don't know yet. So basically, this is what I've got so far. And uh, what else can I put on here? Maybe some of this. So, uh, oh, got it on the metal bit of the brush. I'm really sorry this is late going up, guys. It's just. I didn't actually know if I would have had time to uh, do it today, so that's why it's kind of late as well. And then by the time I got home for the doctors, it ended up that the stupid bus broke down. And we were sitting for like half an hour waiting on the bus, the other bus to come. And then when the other bus did come, the driver that uh, from the broken down bus stood and talked to him for about 20 minutes. So basically it took me an hour like to get home because the stupid buses broke down. Um, what else can I do here? I'm gonna just add a wee bit of nail polish I think. And since this is only nail polish and black nail polish I've got to hand, I'll just use this. So I'm just gonna, because I don't like this white. I know you can't really see it that well because it's I don't like the white, so I'm just going to go over it with the nail polish. I wish I could zoom these in, but I don't know how to do it on this camera. So you could actually see what I'm doing. But basically I'm just painting along the, the edges of the paper, just to get rid of that um, white. That's what I'm doing guys, just randomly painting around the paper just to get rid of the, the white. And then we'll see what else we can add. Nail polish is brilliant. I love nail polish. It's so good. Yeah, it stinks. But it's really good for your art as well, for painting and stuff like that. And like you get so many different colours and different styles like you get your crackle and all that kind of stuff so 
and it's cheap. You know, you can get like the crackle from the dollar store or pound shop or whatever. And uh, it's cheap, you know, so it's a lot better than actually like spending the money to go out and buy the actual crackle paint and stuff like that. And uh, I have tried the crackle and it works on paper as well, so it does work. So I'm just kind of giving this a click. I'm just basically going all over the place with it at the moment and I know the light's not too well at the, like on the camera but um, so that's what I've got so far so I've just kind of randomly went over with the, the gold nail polish just to get a bit of colour and then I'm going to get a bit of my sequins oh. I'm going to get a bit of my sequins or whatever you call it, punchella, or I don't know, I can't see it right. Um, I'm just going to get a wee bit of this. Yeah, so I probably won't be doing a lot of the challenges um, this week. It is my turn this week, but obviously because it's been busy, it's going to be a busy week. The girls have offered to fill in for me, which I really appreciate, girls. So. Now is the tricky part, I try to get this a jar opened. Oh my god. No. It's stuck solid, guys. Maybe I can prize owned. I've done that before, prize owned. But I just need to be careful because I'm wearing this top and it's a new top usually when I'm. In fact. I know that people were saying use Vaseline and stuff like that, but it's just isn't working. Ah. I hate this jar of chest so Give me a second guys, I'm just going to pause because I don't really think he's want to see me try to open this. <laughs> I'll pause and I'll come back when I get opened. Okay, I got it opened, but what did I do with that bit of sequin that I just cut off? So, I changed my top, as you can see. I'll try to get these down a bit further so you can actually see what I'm doing. This is harsh. Huh? So, let's see. I'm just trying to square up a bit so you can actually see what I'm doing. So, the other card. And I'm just going to go over it with some just so. I managed to get it opened, I had to prize it opened. So, where's that page? So, I'm just gonna get a few wee dots, but interest, if it lights me. Aye, good you know, Marie. I'm trying to, like, gesso over tape. <sighs> Seriously not my day today. I slept in this morning and uh, then I got off this at the wrong stop for what I usually get off with because I had to get a different bus and then I didn't recognise where I was going so I get lost and oh, uh, then the bus broke down I was like, oh my god, what next? This just is not my day today. It was just one thing after another. And that's not showing up very clearly. That's a bit better. It's not great because it's going over the metallic paint but it's a bit better I suppose so I see what I've got so far right so I'll we'll just leave that off now um, there's also something else I was wanting to add to it 
a bit off of this. It's got loads of flowers and stuff like that, so I want to actually cut a bit off this and use that on it as well. So I'm going to do that and hopefully I don't cut it too bad and it doesn't break. Right, break a part on there. So I'm going to try my best and try and get it cut so that it doesn't like really fall apart. <laughs> so I'm just kind of fussy cutting it really. And then if I like it, I'll keep it. If I don't, then I'll try something else. Alright, so this is what I've got. So I'll probably need to do a bit of snipping and trimming here because it's kind of you know, what I wanted. So I'm just going to trim it a wee bit play around with that and just try and make it a bit more better looking than what it is because <sighs> at the moment it looks horrible so this is going to be a cool ATC, I think. No, I hope it is anyway. That's a bit better. So that was that one there. Like that. Um, I'll probably need to tape it down. So that's what I'll do. I'm going to try and tape it down and hopefully it sticks because right, I've had a lot of history with this tape and there's been times that it, certain things don't stick to it so let's hope it does this time. Right, so it's a wee bit sticky behind here, so basically I've got some, if I can find it, no it's not, <sighs> give me a sec guys, I'm just trying to find this, let me see if I'm going to go, oh. where is it? So, we have to try and stop it from being so sticky, we have some glitter here, and it's really cute, I'm going to try and make galaxies from them, so it's really sticky still, so I'm just going to get a wee touch of the glitter, and just kind of spread it on and hopefully that picks up the stickiness. I should actually have a bit of paper down here to catch the water so I can put it back in the tub. Right, maybe not that, but there's the papers. Here we go. So this is just to catch, like, to try and get rid of the... I'm just going to pour it on because what doesn't stick and go in the back in the bottle. So I'm just pouring it all on here and as I say it doesn't stick to the tape to stop it from being sticky, it'll go back in its bottle. So I'm just trying to get it so that most of it comes off, the bits that aren't attached to the tape. Just want to try and sprinkle a wee bit more on the tape though, because it's not really... I don't know.
So, this is what I've got so far. Right, I'll probably put it up that way then. Looks better. Actually. So that's what I've got so far, and yeah, there's glitter. So, what I need to do now is try and get this. This is going to be great difficulty because this paper's so flimsy. I'll be trying to put on this paper. <laughs> Fold a bit better in this paper, and then you know, I need to try and get it back in its bottle. Mm. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> oh, it doesn't help the fact that it's such a small bottle as well. Let's try that again. In fact, you want to know what? I'm going to pause. <laughs> I'll be back in a sec. Okay, I'm back. So as I say, this is what I've got so far. Um, and I want to put... Maybe one of these on it as well. Because these are nice and cute. Um, this one just adds a bit more colour to it as well. So, I'm using my String Things CC off that I got for uh, my Christmas. I'm going to attempt to use one anyway. And So I'm going to try and attempt to put this on somehow. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to um trying to find a way to add this because I do like these and I really want to add one of them on my card. Um I'm just trying to figure out a way to do it. That's it. So we shall try and see which way to do it's best. What I might have to do is untie it. And uh, see that's got a lovely wee like heart on it, so I like it. Um, you can't really see the heart unless you turn it round, but I like it. Uh, so I need to try and figure out a way to add this. So maybe if I. So bear with me guys a sec, I'm just trying to figure out the best way to get this added onto the card um, attached onto it, so give me a sec. I'm just trying to figure out how to go about adding it. See if I can untie it or I might need to just snip it a wee bit and just try and tie it up myself. Uh, 
This is tricky. Tricky, tricky. I do really like it, but it's really tricky to put on. So I want to kind of have it like this somehow, maybe. If I put two wee notches in here, and see. Okay, so it's equal. Yeah, okay. I'll try it that way. Yep. It's gonna work I think. Yep. And then we'll just tie it at the back or stick it down somehow but I just, I'll just tie it just to make sure it's secure. <sighs> oh my god, I really suck at tying. It's just kind of fidgety because it's so small but I really want to add it on there. So, and all this get all this is, guys, is just a bit of elasticated cord and some beads attached to it, so you could make your own. And so, See so what I've got, and then you can like move the beads around a wee bit, spread them out like that. And it gives that a bit of colour as well. And then what I'll do is I'll just kind of put a wee bit of double sided tape down here because I don't think the glue is going to help. So I'll just put a bit of double sided tape down here, and hopefully. And get the string attached to it and it'll make it a bit more secure and then probably after that I'll just uh, cover this but anyway with paper um, so I just need to trim this Sorry guys, I'm I know I'm off camera but I'm just basically that's all I've done at the back. I've just put the two two wee slits on each side, strung my wire in, uh, and then I've just tied it at the back and now I'm just trimming it off. And I've put a wee bit of sticky sided tape down just to try and hold it in place so it's a wee bit more secure. And you just do that and you can mess about your beads or whatever. Um, and then what else do I want to add to this? I think that's it really, just um, maybe uh, I'm sure I brought a pen on with me but what did I do? Oh, that's the question I'm positive I brought a pen on did I bring a pen on? I'm sure I did if not if all these feels tight, two seconds. I'm back. I just want to try one thing out. I had to go and get my sharpie pen. So I just want to add this in the centre. This little clock in the centre here. With the flower. And then I want to get some scrap paper. And try this. And just write. Oh, let's see, where am I going to put it? Happy. Where am I going to put it? 
I'm just going to do, I'm not going to have a lot of room to put two, Happy New Year, so I'm just going to write 2015, and that's pain and all. but hey -oh. So that's what I'm going to do, I'm just going to write in here, 2015, and stick this on somehow. I'm going to use the paint and go down the edges. So it stands out a bit more. And the top of my list for New Year is um, a white paint, a decent white paint. I'm planning to get a decent white pen because I don't have any white pens. So I would have put Happy New Year in, but as I say, I've not got any room. So, and I know the clock is kind of the wrong time. In fact, nah, I'm going to take the clock back off because that's not even the right time. It'd be alright if it was at 12, but it's not. So, I'm just going to take that back off and just put 2015 on here or oh, should I put it down here I'm uh, just going to put it down here so what in my set guys I'm just trying to get myself organised here my paint, ugh, paintbrush is pure messed up I don't even know where my wee tub of water is either I think it's a wee tub of water and I don't know what I've done with it there it's there because yeah Paint's hardening up. And I've probably ruined this, but hey ho. Let's get a go. Yep. But I can dry that and just go over that so it's not too bad. up on me. So, there you go guys, a cute little New Year's ATC. So I hope you enjoy it and I hope you can um, join me and uh, as I say, just because I'm using this stuff doesn't mean to say you have to, you can use whatever you like. Um, you can do whatever style you like, whatever, just try and do a New Year's ATC. And anyway guys, I'm off, so I shall speak to you soon. Bye for now. Bye.